Hello guys, how are you? I'm going to talk to you guys about a subject that I think uh, needs some uh, attention and I think is of interest to many people. Um, while I speak to you guys, I'm going to be putting some models uh, so you guys can check them out. Um, this is um, a group of models that I just posted in um, YouTube a few days ago. And, um, and these are um, Mark three models that have been modified. This, of course, is a model that is uh, built regular from the plastic kit, this one over here. And of course, this one is a model that has been modified from the plastic kit also, but it has been changed and um, now is true scale. And I'll be putting uh, um, the models so you can appreciate the difference while I speak. The subject that I wanna speak today is about higher quality models, building higher quali quality models. Um, if you pay attention, there's a lot of places where you can find information and in how to paint models to a higher quality. But when it comes to um, building models to a higher or different uh, standard or quality, there's not much too much information. There's not much information that you guys can find in the internet. There's hundreds and hundreds of uh, places and channels that where people explain how to paint models. I mean, models that. Uh, uh, different styles of painting but when it comes to building the models that we buy uh, mostly everybody just uh, follow I mean uh, this uh, um, this uh, different um, guys that we get when when we buy the, 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 the models and mostly everybody end up with models that uh, look the same because we follow this uh, uh, different um, rule books that come with the with the kids. I mean, it's no surprise, right? Um, so, uh, most people, ninety nine percent, ninety nine point nine nine percent, I would say, that follow those uh, instructions and they end up with the models that they end up. And uh, this channel, I'm going to touch on uh, the subject of making uh, better looking models. I want to make clear that. Uh, it is not only about making a model big. It is not just increasing the size. The size is increased if it is needed or if it is going to bring something to, to um, the model. It's going to make it more appealing when it comes uh, in an aesthetic way, uh, more eye appeal to the model. So it's not only making the model big. You can Now, if you're a person that only cares about playing the game, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, kudos to you, okay. I mean, you can play um, the game with the models from the first and second edition. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. But if you care about building different models, um, maybe you want a special character, maybe you want um, a captain, maybe you want some variety in in your army maybe you don't want to end up with the same looking models i think that um we need more in uh, in in the community about this subject because there's not much uh, out there right now that touches that subject uh for example all these models that you see over here all of them come from the plastic gw kit i mean every single one of them and um this model over here this model over here is the only model that has been built um, following the um, the rules. All the other models that you see uh, are models that have been modified. They also come from the same plastic uh, GW kit. But there is no way on planet Earth that you can tell me that this model looks better than the rest. I mean, these models, in my opinion, look better than the model that has been uh, built and the reason for that is that I think that the plastic kit, when it comes to Mark III, okay, has some deficiency. I mean, in my opinion, um, the body is improved if you, uh, the look is improved if you, if you, um, a true scale, if you make some modifications into, into the, um, the model. And um, that's a, what I want to concentrate in the channel is to make models um, better looking. So, 
uh, for whatever reason. I just want to make sure that this is understood. I don't want um, people to get offended. Many times I think that a lot of people, when you touch the subject, uh, feel that you're telling them that the models that they already built don't look good. In my opinion, this look good. But in my opinion, this looks better. You know? And there's nothing wrong with it. Um, if you have any comments, um, comment in the comment se section. You can ask me questions. I will start doing some tutorials and uh, sharing some of the information that I have gathered. Um, because uh, as I say, you know, I see that there is not much information that I see when it comes to, to the subject. Um, and there's a lot of information. There's a lot of stuff when it comes to painting, but there's not too much information when it comes to uh, building the models. And I want to change that. Subscribe to the channel, guys. And as I say, I'm going to start doing some short tutorials where I'm going to start giving a few tips in how to make these models look better, how to increase the model if it is necessary, kit bash, um, uh, kit bash, but uh, trying to get a, a higher standard of uh, looking uh, models. Maybe this applies also to people that would like uh, to paint uh, models for display reasons. Uh, or sometimes people that want to play with them. I mean, uh, it can it can go either way. It doesn't matter, okay? But um, as I explained before, um, I am more concentrated in poses. I am more concentrated in um, the anatomical um, structure of the model. So it, it looks good to the eye. Um, it looks realistic, okay? Then the aspect of painting, in my opinion, and that is the part that, that I concentrate more. And uh, as I explained before, there's already enough uh, information out there when it comes to uh, painting models and um, not too much information when it comes to a higher uh, degree of quality when it comes to building models. Most people just follow the rules. And uh, I don't personally, I don't think I have uh, built a model uh, following the rules, I don't know, in the last 10 years. Uh, with the exception of these few models that I use for for uh, samples. Uh, subscribe to the channel, guys, and uh, let me know what you think about in the comments about the subject. Um, let me know what you think about um, the statements that I made, that there's not too much information about uh, models being built uh, to a better standard, and um, that uh, not too many people understand this, in my opinion. And uh, we'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye.